Oh, being Tom is, <laughs> I was lucky and privileged to work with Bing, and uh, uh, he, he was uh, my mentor, teacher, friend, like for me, like he was everything. Like doesn't matter how creative I am, he always tried to push me one step further to, to make the project better. I, I look in his energy, he was tireless. Like we said, Seven o'clock from the morning to 11 o'clock in the evening. We are breakfast, work, uh, uh, concert. It's not nonstop. He's been a father, a friend, probably the biggest mentor that I've had um, and influenced me. He never let us be complacent. He always uh, helped us stretch ourselves beyond who we were. Um, uh, so even, even when he's gone, um, we always sort of, uh, we rely on each other to, to not settle for anything, we always push the boundaries. And I think what Bing had always taught me was that uh, the most important thing for someone in his career is, is having character and a capacity to endure. And I think those are the elements that we try to bring each day as we come into the office and, um, uh, and uh, on all the projects that we work together as a team. I think, I think he'll be remembered from a couple perspectives. One is as this fighter, as this person who, who wanted to fight compromise, who wanted to fight for better cities. He was a very much an urban champion. And he, was, he, was re he felt really strongly about the role that architecture had in making civilization uh, more successful, in making our urban environments um, more richer. And uh, so I think number one would be the fighter for the good for that cause. The other would be purely aesthetically. I go back to that notion that if you drive past Chan Center at UBC, you know it's a big Tom building without having to ask. I think that that consistency, and I think one of the things that, that's so sad about, about Bing passing away is that he had so much more uh, to do. He had so much more he wanted to do. He had so much more he could have contributed. And that's, that's kind of a ripoff. What I most miss about Bing is that he, um, he was one that could truly show his emotions. He, uh, he had this, this uh, very loud way of expressing himself uh, in any way, shape or form, whether it was happy or he was angry or he was not happy with something. He was really emotional that way. He had this, um, this special curiosity um, for the location where he built projects. He had this uh, extreme curiosity um, to try to understand um, the greater context of where we're building. To, to have him in that as an influence in the way we would build a project for a specific client in a specific location. He would just maintain that. That was just the way he was. 